birthday, won't you? With lots of love from Mummy, Daddy and Missy the cat. Happy birthday! Have we got time for one more, Andrew? Oh, quickly, let's have a look. Ben, you are four today. Fantastic card. Have a wonderful birthday, won't you? With lots of love from Mummy, Daddy and little sister, Rachel. Keep your cards coming in to us here at CBB's PO Box 1234, London W12 6WX. We love to get them. Have a wonderful birthday. Come on and get on down to the city, city. where the trains all clatter through. Hey, look at that driver, driver, who want to ride that train on blue. I'm looking way up high to the windy, take a peek from inside view. All those people busy working, busy working. I want to see what they all do. Come on, let's we round the market, and do you hear that hullabaloo? Everybody's busy selling, I want to buy me something new. Down where the pigeons perch and coo Take a taxi ride to the river I want to drive down the avenue Hey, look at those buses gleaming They look so clean and spanking new All lined up to drive around the city Let me ting that bell to the loo I'm gonna ride on right to the school stop Where the children hurry through Sit down, the teacher's teaching I'd love to learn a thing or two Come on and get on down to the city, city. where the fairy box stands in blue. Time to call on Granny Murray. She'd love to say hello to you. Me too. Hello, honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has two at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home too. Who's here today? Well, we've got Hope and we've got Rachel, but don't just sit there, puppets. Come on, let's have some fun. <coughs> What's Granny Murray got on our shelves today? Good girl. Oh, you put a bit on ours. Oh, oh it's falling over. Okay. That's the key. Knock them all down. Hey, well done. Well, we've got Hope and we've got Rachel. But someone's missing from home today. Oh, not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Oh, it's Jack with Rudy. Hello there, Rudy. Hi, Hi Granny Murray. There and Jack. Well done. Watch your step here, Rudy. <laughs> oh, girls, now Jack's here, we'll do something new. Why don't you all dress Claude up as a firefighter? Oh, fantastic. Yeah, we're going to the fire station later on. <laughs> Nino, oh, Nino, 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 Nino. Oh, what's that? Oh, a wee squeaky toy, sorry. <laughs> And who's this? Bonko the beer. <laughs> oh, the place does seem in a mess this morning, Granny oh, Murray. Oh, I know. It might seem in a bit of a mess, but there's a place for everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, you best make sure you clear up before you visit the fire station. Oh, I'm so looking forward to it. Oh, and I know what I'm going to be doing today, too. Uh, I am going to be a film star. Oh, how exciting. <laughs> who's the film director? Mickey John. He's bringing the school film club to the market to film me at work. I've got to tell them all about my job at the market. <laughs> oh, you'll make a great film star. Oh, will you look at Claude? <laughs> oh, <laughs> well done, my wee flapjacks. Claude looks ready for action. And I'd best get off to work. Dad, it's a star for you. A star? Wow. I'll put this on my dressing room door, lovies. <laughs> <laughs> right, cheers, mate. Give us a good little... Yeah, see you later. No. See you later, guys. Come Bye -bye. on, then. Now remember, there's a place for everything. Thanks, Granny Murray. I'll see you later. I'll be thinking of you, darling. Me too. Now, you keep a wee eye on Rudy and make sure he goes the right way to work. I'm on my way to work today. I'm walking my shoes through the city views. I'm stepping along and I'm swinging me arms and I'm singing my way through the city's charms. 
Getting there, it's just so fine. I so enjoy my walking time. I always go the way I know, but can you tell me the way I go? Hey! Okay, which way? And do I go left now? Or do I go right? Which way is wrong now? And which way is right? Hey! Okay, that way, to the market. I'm on my way to work today. I'm going this way and that away. Hello, cobbles. Hello, train. Hello, roadworks. Hello, tram. Hello, sweeper. Hello, bag. Do I go down? Which way's a smile now? And which way's a frown? Ah! What, this way? You told me the way to go Thank you, you showed me the way I know Thanks for that! Now what? Ah yeah, I need to put on my work clothes All dressed and ready to go. <laughs> there we have it. This stall's officially run by a film star now. Right, what's first? Ah, oranges. <laughs> Come on, folks, get your lovely, juicy, juicy oranges. Buy ten oranges, and I'll throw in a free Rudy the Film Star autograph. Who's <laughs> going through the turnips? Hello there, Raymond. How are you doing? I'm fine, thanks. I'm just practicing the lines for our new musical show. Ah, oranges. That's just what I need to keep me fit and healthy for the opening night. I'll have uh, two, please. Two oranges coming right up. Us actors need to keep ourselves fit. <laughs> oh, funny you should say that, Raymond. Actually, I am going to be an actor myself. You see, Mickey John is bringing the school film club here to make a film about me in the market. Oh, <laughs> fantastic. So, what style of acting were you planning to portray? You could be super cool and barely move a muscle. What? Or you could be very theatrical. <laughs> Raymond, Raymond, calm down. Just, just calm down. I don't have to do any acting as such. It's more about me. It's about what I do here in the market all day. I've just got to be myself. Oh, uh, right -o. Well, mm, eight o'clock. My train will be leaving soon. Thanks for the oranges. <laughs> and good luck with the film. Be a star. <laughs> Cheers, Raymond. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, be a star, eh? I wonder what you're up to, Jack. I love to skip in Riversy Bingle, Riversy Bingle by the sea. I love to skip in Riversy Bingle, Riversy Bingle, that's for me. <gasps> oh, look! There's a fireman's pole. The fireman slide down that very quickly in an emergency and jump into the fire engines. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, let's go and see a fire engine. <gasps> Whoa! Oh, firefighters to the rescue! <gasps> that looks like good fun, doesn't it? <laughs> Who can make a noise with a fire engine? Sure thing. <laughs> there we go, madam. That will be two pounds, please. <laughs> Are they for anyone special? Yes, absolutely. They're for someone very special. They're for you. Huh? Me? <laughs> How come? To say, good luck in your performance, darling. Or, as we in the trade say, break a leg. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Thanks, Tina. I'll just put them here, right next to Jack's stall. <laughs> <laughs> Bye! See you later, Tina. <laughs> oh, right, before Mickey John gets here with the film crew, I'd best get down to some hard work. And doobie-dooby-doo, I make it look easy. What I doobie-dooby-doo, and what I do is sell to you and you and you all of the veggies for a stew. But it's more than meets the eye. 
what I do for you as I by and by. While you still sleep, those fruit and veg to eat, and the flowers in the early hours. So when wake up comes, it's there for you. The market stalls are there to view. Oh, the market, the market, what a wonderful place! Oh, the hub of the people, the smiles on each face. Oh, the market, the market, come look around. Oh, the hustle, the bustle, the bubbles of sound. The colours all chaotic and spilling about. The smells all exotic. Yeah, the market cries out. Objects to excite you and draw you near. The buying and the selling, cheap or dear. The market, the market. I just love to be there. The market is a wonderful place. Oh, being a film star must be easier than running a market stall. <laughs> Aye, Rudy. How's my star today? Ready to give an Oscar-winning performance, I hope. Oh, I think so, Mickey John. What do you want me to do? Ah, uh, well, just tell us what it's like to run a market stall. OK for sound? Camera ready? Rudy on the market stall. Take one. And... Action! <clears throat> well, um, well, hello, everybody. My name's Rudy. Um, and, well, first of all, I want to say that uh, the market's a really, really cool place to work. Cut! It Oh, love it, love it. But I just think we can frame this shot better, so... Uh, now, I'll just swap these... ...with these. Lovely. OK, OK for sound. Camera still running. And action! Um, so, um, what was I saying? Um, oh, the, the market is a really cool place to work. Oh, oh, and it's dead friendly, too. Cut! Oh, you're really flying, Rudy, you're really flying. But I just think, if I swap this... And this. Yes. Now we're on to something. OK? Action! Um, so, so, um, so, so, so the market, the market is a really, really brilliant place to work. Um, and, well, my name's Rudy, I'm looking swell, and I'm ready to sell. Cut! That's an up! Rudy, you're a natural. When this film gets shown, you'll be a star! <laughs> right, come on, guys. Let's get off and start editing. Bye, Rudy. Bye, Mickey John. See ya. <laughs> oh, that went pretty well. I can't wait to show my film to Jack and he can see me starring role. <laughs> I love to skip the river, see bingo, river, see bingo, that's for me. <gasps> oh, look how shady Wow. <laughs> I want to be in that seat. Look how high ya. That's a boy. Oh, Jack, drive the fire engine. Beep, beep. Look at all the equipment. There's standpipes and hoses. No, 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 hose. That makes ten hoses. Ten hoses? And everything's got a place so the fireman can find it quickly. Yes, it's all very neat and tidy, isn't it? <laughs> Doing now, Daddy? Hi, Rudy. You've been busy? Oh, hello there, Bobby. I'm always busy, but never too busy to serve me favourite bus cleaner. Oh. <laughs> right, firstly, I need three bacon potatoes. Three bacon potatoes, not a problem. I keep them just. Hang on. Th these are oranges. I also need one cauliflower. Uh, cauliflowers? Yep, yeah, then keep them. Hang on a minute. This is, this is a turnip. And I also need some bananas. Oh, that bunches of bananas. They just drop. Hang on a minute. This is a bunch of grapes. What's going on? Well, it looks as if everything on your store is in the wrong place. Oh, I think you're right, Bobby, but how did this happen? I've, I've been working hard all morning and I've got a busy afternoon stretched ahead of me and now I don't know where anything is on the stall. Oh, where did the time go? At six o'clock I dropped off Jack at Granny Murray's and I soon found out that the floor was covered with toys. I told Granny Murray that Mickey John was coming to film me at the market and Jack gave me a star. At seven o'clock I got to work and stuck the star on my stall. Raymond bought some of my oranges to keep healthy for his new show and I told him I was going to be in a film. At nine o'clock Tina arrived in her taxi. She bought a bunch of flowers and gave them to me as a good look present for me film. Then at one o'clock Mickey John arrived with the school film club. 
I started to be a film star and told them all about what it's like to work on a market stall. But Mickey John kept on changing my stall around. He said it would look better in the film. Then at two o'clock, when Bobby came to my stall to do her shopping, everything she asked for was in the wrong place because Mickey John had muddled it all up. I couldn't find anything. Now remember, there's a place for everything. There's a place for everything, of course. I need to sort this stall out and put everything back where it should be. <laughs> and it's a race against time. I've got to do it, I've got to do it. I've got to beat the clock before the chime. I've got to sort it, I've got to sort it. I've got to do the job on time. I like a busy bee, I'm gonna beat that bong. I'm gonna finish this job before I finish this song. Do we think he's gonna do it? Do the job that needs to be I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna beat the clock before the chime. I'm gonna sort it. I'm gonna do the job on time. Like a busy bee, I'm gonna beat that bong. I'm gonna finish this job before I finish this song. <laughs> Everything in its proper place. <laughs> Looking swell and ready to sell. <laughs> Rudy, my order. Oh. What was it, Bobby? Um, potatoes, uh, cauliflower and bananas? <laughs> Ta da! Hey! Great! That's just what I needed. <laughs> Fantastic. It was easy to find once I got my stall sorted. Everything has its proper place. <laughs> You're a star. <laughs> Mwah. Bye! See you later, Bobs. <laughs> I wonder how my little star's getting on. <laughs> I miss you, Daddy. Ricky, come Hi, away, please. Look who's here, Jack. Yes. <laughs> Kiss a cuddle. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like you've had a good time with Granny Murray. Yeah. Oh, we certainly did. <laughs> Say thank you to Granny Murray. Thank you. Oh, come on, a great boy. <laughs> <laughs> and thanks from me too, Granny Murray. I remembered what you said. There's a place for everything, and it saved the day. Oh, well, well. Come on, you two. You'll want to be off. <laughs> Come on, mate. Bye-bye, my darlings. I'm looking forward to next time. <laughs> me too. Bye. Come on, Jack. Let's talk about our time away. And I suppose you want me to tell you all about my time too. Well, there was playing <laughs> Granny Chasing, painting, laughing, digging, bathing, dressing, singing, swinging, walking, sliding, hunting, hiding, jumping up and turning round, dressing up and sitting down. <sighs> but what was really special about today? Well, Claude was dressed up as a firefighter because we were off to visit the Riversea Fingal Fire Station. Rudy had exciting plans too. He was going to be a film star at the market. It was very exciting at the fire station. We saw the pole that the firefighters slide down and all their protective uniforms lined up neatly, ready to wear in an emergency. There really was a place for everything. Later we watched the firefighters as they practiced and Jack got to sit in the fire engine. He felt like a star. Rudy was a star too at the market in Mickey John's film. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Me too. Bye bye, honey pie. I love to skip in Riversea Fingal, Riversea Fingal, bye. I love to skip in Riversea Fingal, Riversea Fingal, that's for me. Come on and get on down to the city, where the fairy folks dance the blues. Time to call on Granny Marie. She'd love to say goodbye to you. It's the weekend, so Andrew, what job have you got for me? 
And Doctor, brilliant! Any patience? Yes, I can look after them. Oh, and a pilot. OK, you want me to fly a plane as well? <laughs> no problem. And a king. Well, I can't do all these jobs at once.